Hey, yo, what's up? What's going on, man? Hope y'all doing good out there. All right, so my last video, um, I talked about synthetic urine. I talked about synthetic urine, and I talked about subsolution synthetic urine, and how that's pretty much hands down one of the best synthetic, synthetic urine, urines that's out there. Um, it's because it has all of the chemicals that contains all of the consistencies and the smells and the actual, like, like it looks like actual urine, right? And it has all of the chemicals that's, that, that will be found in natural urine. And that's why they've been successful and that's why they've been making it happen. So, um, if you haven't, make sure you go check out my previous video on that. If you have a urine test coming up. Because I know that's the most common test, right? Um, um, at least now it is. But, a lot of you probably not in that position. A lot of you probably have, um, probably got a drug test coming up that's going to be monitored. Where someone's literally like standing there, right? And when you're in that position, the synthetic urine, it's going to be hard to pull that off with somebody sitting there watching you. So that's not the best route to take. And a lot of you, man, um, you probably just don't want to deal with it. You probably don't want to deal with um, dealing with the synthetic urine and following the instructions, although it's relatively easy. You probably just don't want to do that anymore. Or you probably just don't want to take the route of smoking anymore. Like, that's very possible. So uh, I wanted to talk about toxin rid which um, which is a detox pill and they got detox programs and stuff like that to help you completely clean your system of everything. Now keep in mind, um, when you're dealing with uh, detox, let's say the natural detox, um, you guys know there's a bunch of natural detoxes out there, right? But the thing is, there's so many factors that comes into play when you're dealing with a natural detox, right? Um, body weight, height, male or female, body fat body fat percentages right your metabolism how fast is your metabolism um does your body do well at burning off toxins fast like there's a lot of stuff that comes in, into play that you really don't know about your body so granted of course a uh, natural detox system works right of course it works because you're not taking in any drugs and over time you know it starts to flush out your body yes it works but does it work fast enough for your current situation and that's what you have to ask yourself in toxin rid it's like 50 percent faster than the traditional um natural um, i mean the traditional detox programs that's out there right and that's the big difference and the best part about toxin rid is that they have the different programs they have the different detox programs one day two day three day five day seven day ten day like whatever you need now, it's highly recommended that you go for the the 7 to 10 day because obviously the longer you have to get rid of um, uh, the, the, the THC toxins and stuff in your body, the longer you have to get rid of that in your body, um, the more effective you're going to be when it comes to the test. You know, that, that that's obvious right there. So, that's how, um, that's how that's played out. So, if you can... Use the seven to ten because seven to ten is 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 going to be the sweet spot. But a lot of people don't have that time, right? So you may have to get the five day one or something like that. But the key to this is monitoring, right? So make sure you get you a few at home drug tests. Get you a few, and especially when you're doing this process and you got toxin red, you jumped on the program. Let's say you jumped on the ten day program, and let's say you're ready to go and you're on. So make sure you get the test. Bring the test back. And when you jump on the toxin rid program, let's say you jumped on the seven day detox program, you're taking the pills, you know, drinking a lot of water and, you know, and stuff like that. Make sure that you're monitoring your tests throughout. Okay, so get the at-home drug test and monitor yourself after two days, after three days, you know, just to see where you are in the process. Granted, at the end of it, you're going to be completely fine, but you want to monitor yourself throughout the process and make sure you're, um, Make sure you're in a position in which you are, you know, you're moving forward. And a lot of thing, a lot of a lot of mistakes, not a lot of things, a lot of mistakes that people make is when they follow when they're following the, um, this detox program. A lot of people they don't know that you know you have to be cautious of what you consume moving forward until you finish the program, man. So for one, don't smoke more while you're doing it. Like that's not gonna help. Um, drink a lot of water and try to stick to water only, man. Like, that's it. No sugary, high fructose corn syrup crap. 
None of that stuff, right? Because you want your body at its natural state. You want to put as much water in it. Like we're made up of like 80 something percent water. So you definitely want a bunch of water, you know? Um, don't smoke cigarettes. Like don't smoke cigarettes. Don't smoke anything that's going to slow down your metabolism and things like that and just slow you down. Also, um, caffeine. Try to limit your caffeine intake. I know it's hard to not drink coffee for a lot of people, but when you're using the toxin red you know detox pills you don't want to be on coffee or any high caffeinated products right because it's going to slow your metabolism down and you want your body clean completely clean another thing make sure you eat a lot of fruits and veggies you know more so a lot of veggies because fruits have a lot of sugar but it's also good for you make sure you have a lot of veggies man a lot of veggies try to stay away from the fried stuff the fried foods and things like that try to stay away from those when you're on, on the toxic red um, detox pills also um, exercise exercise regularly all right try to sweat it out man especially um, fasted cardio so that's um, early morning first thing in the morning cardio you know going to run do some burpees or do something like that in order to get just just flush your body you know and by the end of the um, the program that you chose to get on the seven to ten day program or whatever whatever program you chose to get on um, by the end of it, you should be completely fine. You know, um, Toxin Red is amazing. Um, they've been in the business, man. They've had a ton of success. And that's for anyone out there who wants to just get rid of everything. You want to get rid of, you want to flush everything, right? So make sure you guys check it out, man. I'm going to have a link to everything in the description. It's going to be there. In fact, I'm uploading it right now for you guys in regards to, you know, I'm getting the links to everything you need um and to make sure you guys are all good man so and keep in mind um every toxin rip program for you guys you know it's um it's the same method man it's the same method they're gonna have all the instructions they're gonna have everything you need and just everything everything's gonna be laid out step by step depending on which program you want you're gonna know exactly what you need to do so it's your it's your goal to just follow it man just follow the program see it through trust the process and it's going to be all right, man. So I'm going to have a link to everything. It's going to be there. So make sure you check it out. Also, marijuana101.org. Make sure you check that out for more information. And with that being said, man, appreciate y'all guys for watching, man. You got any questions, drop those in the comments. And I'll see y'all soon. Peace.